Welcome to another episode of Travel Time. Subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with the latest uploads. Let's get into today's video. Las Vegas isn't everyone's cup of tea. It's the kind of city that people either love or hate. There seems to be no in-between. That being said, there is a heap of the best things to do in Las Vegas that are dotted all across the city. Honestly, Las Vegas is the kind of city that just sucks up your time, and not always in a bad way. There are so many distractions, places, events, and foodie spots that kind of make the city a mind-boggling effort to explore. Now, first things first, don't think of Las Vegas like any other city in the United States. It's completely different, and isn't even set up like a traditional city in itself, at least not for visitors. It's a city that thrives on people, spending money, let's be honest, and fun. This is why Las Vegas has been given the name Sin City. Though, just like any city, you can make up your time to have the best experiences and really have fun exploring and chilling. With that in mind, take a look at some of the best things to do in Las Vegas to have the best trip. 1. Scale the Strat Upon getting to the top, you'll get to see all across Las Vegas and the wider region of Nevada, too. 2. See a show One of the great things about having so many people in Las Vegas, and lots of winnings, is that there's a heap of shows, concerts, and music events that are world-renowned and easy to visit. From past residencies from the likes of Elton John, Cher, Celine Dion, and Lady Gaga to Cirque du Soleil, they're amazing. 3. Helicopter over the Grand Canyon Not only will you see the incredible Grand Canyon from Las Vegas, but you'll also get some delicious champagne too. Just be sure to book in advance. Places fill up really fast at peak times, and you don't want to be disappointed. Usually a few hundred dollars each, they tend to go up in price depending on what package and whether if you want to land is included. Whatever you choose, it's a great little way to get a taste of one of the most famous canyons in all the world. Tours, including transfers and briefings, usually last a few hours, and it's well worth it if you fancy something different. Just make sure to ask for any deals, etc. There's always some sort of offer, especially from your hotel concierge, who will usually be on the commission to get you to book. 4. Visit the casinos Casinos are what made Las Vegas famous, and visiting them? It's easily one of the best things to do in Vegas, and something that made the city famous. Now, with all the casinos in Las Vegas, they're huge, expansive, and designed to make you spend. Keep this in mind, and you'll do well. Also, a good thing to remember is that you don't even need to buy a drink in a casino. You'll regularly see hosts wandering the floors who will gladly fix you your drink of choice. Just remember to leave a tip each time, and you'll be guaranteed a returning host to grab your next round for free. Oh, yeah, and remember that casinos rarely have windows or clocks to remind you when to leave. Keep an eye on the time, and even set an alarm if you don't want to spend all day exploring the slots. That all being said, it's one of the best things to do in Las Vegas. 5. See the Bellagio Fountains Take a wander outside to see the impressive fountains. They're huge, and some of the biggest in all of North America. 7. See the Las Vegas sign Okay, so this is old school, but still one of the best things to do in Las Vegas. Go see the Las Vegas sign! Perched beyond the Luxor Hotel, it's one of the oldest signs in Las Vegas and draws quite a crowd. Now, you'll likely only spend 10 minutes here, but it's well worth seeing if you're interested in the older side of Las Vegas. 7. Drive to Death Valley if you fancy a little time out of Las Vegas, take a tour of Death Valley and visit one of the hottest places in the whole world. It's totally stunning and so surreal to see. Now, just remember to prep in advance and pack lots of water and supplies. Temperatures can be scorching here and it's very dangerous if your car breaks down. 
8. Explore the Strip It's huge and quite long, too. In fact, it's likely you won't walk at all, and you'll find monorails and taxis at each hotel if you don't fancy it. This all being said, it's a great way to see Las Vegas and find some surprises along the way. You'll come across every kind of shop, show, and street performer you can ever imagine. 9. Visit the Neon Museum Created back in the 1990s at the height of casinos being demolished and mega casinos being built, the Neon Museum set up a not-for-profit organization to preserve old Las Vegas. Today, you can wander around the Neon Museum and explore the times gone by in the glittering city. It's easily one of the best things to do in Las Vegas if you love history. 10. Fremont Street So, Fremont Street, for me at least, feels a little rough and ready, if that makes sense. It's not got the same Disneyfication that the Strip has, but certainly has a place in the city. Plus, it's one of the best things to do in Las Vegas if you want to see an older part of the city itself. After taking a look through the covered walkway, hop on the zip line and zoom through the crowds. It's totally fun. And with that, we've reached the end of this video. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more content just like this. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.